Hello, everyone, and welcome to another episode of Reading Rainbow. My name is Randall Fields, and I'm your host. And today we are going to read about butterflies. Now, this is reading is for everyone. It's not only for children. It's for adults, for ESL learners especially, um, to help you with your reading. And it's also just to sit down, relax unwind and just listen to something educational. That's all. So this is Explore My World. I have the book here. I hope you can see that. And um, so we're going to read this book. And this is by Marley Ferguson Delano. That's a very beautiful butterfly there. Learn about the magical world of butterflies, their beauty, their importance, and their incredible metamorphosis and migration. Oh, that is such a beautiful picture. Look. Butterflies, fluttering, floating, zigzagging by. They flash like jewels in the sunlit sky. They flit over fields and wander through woods. They glide into gardens and dance through deserts. What are butter butterflies looking for? flowers to feed on. When a butterfly lands, it tastes the flower with the tips of its feet. This flower tastes sweet. Deep inside, it is a sugary liquid called nectar. The butterfly unrolls a long tube on its head and pokes it into the flower. Herp. The butterfly uses the tube like a straw to suck up the nectar. What's for lunch? How does a butterfly taste its food? Some butterflies drink nectar from almost any flower. Others are picky eaters. They only feed on certain flowers. Do you think dead bugs taste yucky or yummy? What's your favorite fresh apples or rotten ones? A few butterflies prefer to dine on rotting fruit or even dead bugs. Here are some butterflies with their favorite foods. These butterflies like bananas. Do you like them too? Guess what kind of juice this butterfly likes to sip. It's raining. To keep dry, a butterfly folds up its wings and perches below a leaf. At night, a butterfly hangs upside down to sleep. To warm up in the morning, a butterfly spreads its wings wide and soaks up the sun. A butterfly's life may seem fancy free, but any moment. Swoop! A hungry monkey might sneak up and snatch it. A mouse might munch it. A bird 
might nab it. A lizard might zap it. How can butterflies stay safe? Some hide by blending in with the world around them. Some have spots on their wings that look like eyes. Eye spots scare away enemies. Boo. A rainbow of colors. A butterfly's wings are covered with thousands of tiny powdery scales. These scales create the insect's beautiful colors and patterns. Each scale is a single color. Here are some butterflies from around the world. How many of them have eye spots? Small tortoise shell butterfly Eurasia. Blue Morpho Butterfly, South Central America. Common Mormon Butterfly, Asia. Common Buckeye Butterfly, North America. Pallas frilla, oh, <laughs> Fritillary Butterfly, Eurasia. Blue Pansy Butterfly, Asia, Australia. Oh, and I forgot one. Um, the Asian swallowtail butterfly from Asia. Well, wow, that one's a really nice one. Looks like uh what do you call it? A stone glass or stained glass, yeah, in churches. Hmm. A mother butterfly flies from plant to plant, tasting them with her feet. She's looking for one her babies can eat. When she finds the right plant, she lays her eggs on it. That one looks like a moth. The eggs hatch and out creep the babies. The babies are tiny caterpillars, very hungry caterpillars. A caterpillar gobbles up the plant it's on. It eats and eats. It grows and grows. Wiggle. It grows so big its skin splits. The caterpillar wiggles out of it. Then it gets too big for its new skin again. And again, this happens. Eat, grow, split, wiggle. I see. One day, the caterpillar hangs upside down from a leaf or twig. It makes a hard, thin shell around its body. The shell is called a chrysalis. Inside the chrysalis, something amazing happens. The caterpillar changes into a butterfly. After days or weeks, the chrysalis splits open. Out crawls the new butterfly. The butterfly's wings are crumpled and wet, but soon... They straighten out and dry. Fly, butterfly. Now the butterfly is ready to take off. To fly, to flash like a jewel in the sunlit sky. From 
egg to butterfly. One egg. How many eggs do you count on this leaf? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two caterpillar. How do you think this caterpillar would feel if you touched it? Hmm. I don't know. Hairy, maybe. Chrysalis. What big change happens in this stage? Hmm. And finally, four, butterfly. Guess what's on the other side of these wings? Eye spots. All butterflies go through four very different stages. Here's the life cycle of a blue morpho butterfly. Spire butterfly. Some butterflies are very good at hiding in plain sight. Can you find the butterfly in each picture? Yes, wow. They are very good at as evolution. Survival of the fittest. Right? Grow a butterfly garden. You can lure butterflies to your home by planting their favorite flowers in your yard or in pots. Grow tall plants and short plants. Plant lots of flowers so the butterflies can slurp nectar. Plant brightly colored flowers. Choose a sunny spot. What colors do you see in this garden? Butterfly friendly plants. These butterfly friendly plant plants. Milkweed, butterfly bush, daisies. A word is very hard to pronounce. Phlox. Joe pie weed. Cone flowers. Zinnias. Marigolds. And daylilies. And that is the end of this book. We are finished. I hope that was relaxing for you. And please. Don't forget. To like. And subscribe. And remember that reading is fundamental. My name is Randall Fields, and this is Reading Brainbow.